Well, you know, it's I've, I've got a lot of BMI awards, fortunately, on my walls over the years. I've been here at, at uh, the awards banquet uh, several different times and been able to accept in person, and it's always meant a great deal to me. I'm as proud of those awards as I am probably any other award I've gotten in my career because it uh, goes to uh, being a songwriter. And, and uh, um, when I started getting multi-million awards from the, you know, the, the million heirs, they call them, um, I, you know, I was always a little stunned that things have been played two, three million times in the case of some of the albums, you know, some of the songs off tracks off albums. So tonight, this is kind of a, a culmination of the 34 years of, of receiving those individual awards, and this is uh, when they called me about it. Uh, late summer and asked if I was willing to come and do nothing. I said, that sounds like a good job, do nothing and, and be applauded. And, I, and I'm very flattered that BMI would honor me with this. You know, I never thought about doing it another way, so it's not like I had a choice, you know, I, I kind of just did what felt was honest, you know, what, what I felt was honest, what felt like what I was doing musically was honest. Very, you get you tied with Shania Twain for the record. Did you ever reach out to her? Or did she reach out to you? I don't know how to, you, one would reach out to Shania Twain. I guess I'll do it now. Okay. Shania, it's an honor to, sh to stand atop of the podium with you if you would ever like to, to reach out. I've heard this man do, man, I feel like a woman. It's great. It's gotta, great. Gotta make it Go happen. to karaoke song for me. Yep. But yeah, the you know album came out a couple days ago, and you know we'll see we'll see what the first week looks like, and, and people seem to love it so far. So I'm having a blast. Do you, are you the kind of guy that reads reviews? I do. You know I do actually. You know, and maybe it's not a healthy thing, but I, you know, I enjoy it. I enjoy hearing what people think, good or bad. You know, I mean, I think, you know, I, I, there's no, I wouldn't want to base anything off of a review of my album, but I feel like there's at some points can be some insight hidden in there for sure. Busby lives on in all of our hearts. We, there's not a day that goes by that in a songwriting room that, that we don't talk about him. I tell a story about Busby every session I have. I, I'll, I was telling somebody the other day he was bragging about doing push-ups in my studio the other day and I was we were doing push-ups on the floor together and he had just been able to do so any Busby had such a profound impact I texted with him all the time and I thought I was the only one that texted him with him like that and turn find out that we all were doing he was texting us all like that and um, I just want to live my life like Busby and 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 you know he, he, he yeah it's had a big impact on me